Well, good morning. That was a great night's rest here at the Roadway Inn. Now we're actually on our way to Minnesota. Minnesota, babe, right? Getting in the car. Minnesota, right, babe? Maybe we're gonna go check out the Badlands first and see what's on the way, but eventually we wanna make it to Minnesota today. Or not. Whoa, my makeup looks so thick. You look like you're wearing lipstick. All right, guys, so we're driving through the Badlands of. <laughs> So we're back in the Badlands. I guess the first one was just a glimpse and this is the actual place because we actually have to pay to get in here. And like I said, it's just dirt and stuff, which is cool, I guess, because there's a lot of different shapes over there. So this is it. The Badlands of South Dakota. We stay on trails even though we're not even getting out. But it's pretty cool, I guess. Some people here are also looking at it. And there's some more views of it. Following Ryan. Up the So we're on our way to Sioux Sex Falls, something like that. I don't know how to say it. We got a hotel there for the night. It's actually already almost 3 o'clock here. It's 2.30 but we're not gonna get to Mall of America today, unfortunately. We're just gonna rest and relax and take it easy and go to the gym there at that hotel because they have one, which Ryan has been dying. He's getting withdrawals. He's like, I need to work out. I need to pump iron. That's his life right there. So yeah. We are new people. We just got haircuts here at Great Clips. Ryan looks like a new man. And I just got layers. The lady that did my hair was really nice. I like that we're in Mitchell. Oh! Ryan. Okay, it's on the Dropped it. Dropped it. We're in Mitchell, South Dakota still. Ooh, my hair smells really good. She put some really good smelling stuff. She said there's no Starbucks here. The nearest Starbucks is in Suix. How do you say it? First on the radio said Sioux. Sioux Falls. Sioux mm. Falls. I don't even know if that's how you say it, but that's it, I guess. Sioux Falls. And she said there's like a caribou. Caribou coffee here right under the bridge or something like that. So she said it's pretty good. Check it out. Shall we? Shall we check it out? Sure. You look like you're wearing makeup in the camera with red <laughs> lips. <laughs> I like the way my hair feels. I'm excited. And the little highlights are still in it. Well, peace. So this is Corn Palace, Mitchell, South Dakota. And it's a whole like storefront looking thing made with corn husks. So we're gonna go inside. That's the nice thing about this place is. Oh yes, cool. This is interesting. So we are inside the Corn Palace, and the outside is made out of corn. And inside is like a little convention center where they have stuff to sell and buy down there. Pretty cool. We want to look around and see what they have to offer. So in this corn palace, they sell all these corn. Micro ear corn, and popcorn, and corn drinks, corn gadgets, corn, corn butter spreader. Yeah, so nifty. Corn bottle corn opener. Paint stir. Is that a corn pizza? Corn in the cab eater thingies. Corn washing things. Corn peeler. Everything here is corn. It's kind of cool.
we got this corn keychain. It's not focusing. Can you touch it? No. <laughs> it's made out of beads. Or six something. So right behind us, we just exited the corn palace. And it actually looks and smells like corn in there. Ooh. And if you open your mouth, you can even taste the corn. And now there's more little shops here to go see. And we can take a selfie with Mr. Corn on the Cob right here. So we just went into the drive-thru of Caribou Coffee, since there's not a Starbucks for another hour from here. And let's do a taste test. I got the vanilla iced coffee with cream, like I always, sometimes always get at Starbucks. <laughs> Mm -hmm. It's strong. It actually has a stronger taste of coffee than the Starbucks one. I like it. It's good. And the bathroom in there, I just went in. It's really cool. Do you like it, Brian? Taste test. It's too hot. I like this coffee. Good job, Caribou. Probably never have another one in my life. We made it to our hotel. Because we've been sitting forever and there's Ryan gonna get his workout on and this is me I'm gonna use this thing and probably just go walk on it because I'm lazy like that but probably not that <laughs> he's working hard check it out hot bod that's what he has Here we are, watching the Caps game in our hotel room. But no one's standing waiting by 30 points. And Ryan is not happy about it. Right, Ryan? Yeah! So we had dinner at Red Robin, so delicious. Now we're just relaxing here in the room, watching basketball. I FaceTimed with one of my students, Ava. She's awesome. I love you. She's in Arizona. And I probably will fall asleep. Not gonna lie. Basketball makes me sleepy. I don't know if it does that to other ladies. Or other ladies actually absolutely love it. But it makes me drowsy. Yeah. Good night, everybody. Bye-bye.